Today, we are excited to release a new responsive editor for Divi 5. This editor allows you to quickly view, modify, and reset responsive hover and sticky states for any setting while in any view mode. In Divi 5, you get the best of both worlds. Natural, intuitive editing, where all changes made while in a particular view mode apply automatically, and the new responsive editor, which allows you to make swift changes to all states at any time. Let me show you how it works. In Divi 5, you don't need to enable responsive editing at the option level. Simply switch view modes and all the changes you make will apply automatically. Intuitive editing significantly reduces unnecessary clicks and removes the cluttered tab interface from Divi 4. In removing this clutter, however, we also removed a key symbol to inform users that a setting has modified values in other view modes, along with a smaller distance between the setting and the view mode switcher. The new responsive editor solves both of these problems. First, you no longer need to move your mouse to the top of the screen to switch view modes and make responsive changes. In fact, you don't need to switch view modes at all. Click the new responsive editor icon and adjust values across all view modes simultaneously. It's especially helpful when you already know the values you want to use, which is often true when using Divi 5's design variable system. It's also a significant improvement over Divi 4 because it lets you quickly overview all the different values applied to a particular setting at any time. There's no need to switch tabs. Divi 5 also lets you know that a setting has additional modified values when the responsive editor icon turns blue. You can easily identify settings with alternate values and quickly modify or reset them in the responsive editor. While on the subject, here's another quick tip for quickly identifying modified responsive values. Turn on Divi 5's modified settings filter, then switch view modes. Easy. The new responsive editor for Divi 5 is available today and is one of many features coming to Divi this year. We are pushing forward incredibly quickly, launching 18 new features in the past six months. This is the promise of Divi 5's new architecture. 2025 is the year of Divi 5. It's time for Divi to make its comeback. You can follow along as we progress through the final release of Divi 5 and beyond with updates every two weeks. You can use Divi 5 now to build new websites or wait until we add more features, whatever works best for you. We want you to try it, and if you love it, use it. When everyone loves it, we'll make it official. In case you missed it, we recently released Woo product modules for Divi 5. This first and most significant batch includes 17 of Divi's 25 Woo modules and brings us one giant step closer to launching the Divi 5 public beta. Our entire team is now focused on finishing the remaining eight modules and addressing the most critical bugs and minor improvements. We're officially on the home stretch. Thanks for watching, and before you go, I have one favor to ask. If you're here for the Divi comeback, let us know by liking this video. It means a lot to see you cheering Divi on, and it's essential to feed the algorithm and spread the word. Don't forget to follow and subscribe so you never miss an update, and I'll see you soon for another Divi 5 feature announcement, which I promise is right around the corner.